Hello everyone and welcome back to Idea Usher, your go-to place for innovation and technology. My name is Abhay Mohan and I'm here to walk you through this intuitive laundry service app. This is an app that we've developed with precision for our esteemed clients to provide for all their laundry needs. So let's get started. When the user first downloads the app, they will be granted this opening splash screen. After clicking past it, they will be taken to the login screen where, if they have an existing account, they can fill in the details and log in. They can also choose to use their Facebook account or Google account to log in. In case the user has forgotten their password, they can hit the Forgot Password button. The user can then type in the email address that they want the OTP to be sent to. This OTP will allow them to type in over here, enter it, hit verify, and then they will be asked to change their password. After changing their password, hit reset, and they will be taken back to the login screen where they can type in their new password. In case the user has never made an account, they can head to the register tab. Here, the user can fill in their details and sign up after making a new account. After logging in, the user will be taken to the home screen where they will be warmly greeted by the app and they can see a number of things. They can see their location, a search function to search for laundry shops, the top services provided by the app, popular laundry shops nearby, and any special packages and offers that the user may avail to get discounts. When the user is trying to decide on which laundry shop is appropriate for them, they may either choose the top rated one on the home screen or they can hit the view all button to see all the nearby shops. They can also choose to click on the map icon button and they can choose the appropriate shop from the map. After selecting a shop, they will be sent to the shop screen where they can see the shop's name, its address, its reviews, how far away it is from the user, the shop's website, an option to call the shop, directions to the shop, and a share link that the user may use to share with their friends, family, or social media. In the About tab, the user can see a brief description about the shop, its address, directions, and opening hours. In the Services tab, the user can see what services are available in that shop. In the Offers tab, the user can see what offers they may avail to get discounts in that shop. In the Price list, the user can see the price per service per item in that shop. Once the user is satisfied, they can schedule a pickup. Here, the user can see that the various items are categorized into men, women, bedding, and household. Here they can choose their items, select how many, and their prices. Once the user has finished filling in the details, they can head to their basket. Here they can see the price per item, the number of items, and the prices total. Once the user is satisfied, they can choose to apply coupons by clicking on apply here. After they have selected a coupon and they are satisfied with the details, they can schedule a pickup. Now they have to decide which address to use for the pickup and the delivery. They can choose to use an existing address or choose to add a new one. Once they have selected their address, hit continue. Here they can choose the pickup date and time and the delivery date and time. Once they have picked the appropriate times, hit continue. In the payment section, the user can choose the appropriate payment method. Here they can see the total price details, the pickup and delivery information that the user has chosen in the previous two sections, and then they can confirm their order. The order has been placed successfully. To check up on the order status, they can click on this. Here the user can see their order number, the total price of the order, the date and time, and the order status, and the various stages. Here the user can see whether the order has been confirmed, or picked up, or in the process, or being shipped, or being delivered. The user can also choose to call the delivery agent or message them. They can also see their pickup and delivery address here. If they wanted to track the delivery agent's location, they can use this option. Here, the user can clearly see the location of the delivery agent on the map. For more details, they can click here. In the booking section, the user can see all the orders they've booked and the various shop names that they've booked them at, 
the order numbers, the prices of the orders, and the various stages of each order. In the Offers page, the user can see all the offers that they may use to avail to get discounts. Finally, in the Profile section, the user can see their picture, their name, and their location. In the Account Info button, they can use to change their account details. The user can see all the addresses stored in this section. The user may also choose to change their password. If the user had any complaints to report or any feedback to give, they may click on Report and Feedback. The user may also get a referral code that they may choose to share with their friends or family. The user can choose to switch on or off app notifications. The user can head to the Settings section to configure the app to suit their needs. So this is how Laundry app works. We hope you've enjoyed this video and feel free to contact us if you want your own app solution. We'll catch you in the next one.